Hello, good afternoon ulit. And uh, since we are uh, done with our uh, in-service training on the use of Microsoft Teams, nakita ko sa inyo kung paano ko tatapusin yung aming required output sa paggawa ng Teams, including our students. So, students were also given their MS account, and that's from DepEd. Kaya, i-include ko sila sa mga teams and channels din na gagawin ko. So, kanina, ang ginawa ko lang is, oh, I open a new tab and then uh, I type in uh, here, office.com. So, pwede natin install yung office. We have an option here to install office. But, I'll skip that process for now. And then, katulad din ng uh, ginawa ko kagabi with my tutorial, punta ako sa MS Team. So, let's check the other apps included in our uh, MS account. Ano ba yung mga iba't ibang pwede nating uh, gawin dito? So, here, I'll click on Teams. And since nakapag-login na ako kanina, uh, it did not require me to... Uh, log in, basta type in your username and then your password. If there is a need to change your password, please do. And then, meron tayong option dito to have the web app or yung ating desktop app. So, basically, ano ba yung pinagkaiba nun? Sa ating web app, yung ginagamit ko ngayon, uh, we can enjoy the core functionalities ng ating MS Teams. But, if uh, you will download yung desktop app. Nandiyan na lahat. Mas mabilis. It's more efficient if you're going to use that. So, click this arrow sa pinakababa ng ating navigation bar dito on the left side. Ito, makikita nyo. Activities, chat, teams, assignment, and then meron tayong dito dot, dot, dot. That's where you can find the other of functionalities, you can make calls, yung uh, store files, organize your schedule in your calendar. So while I'm downloading yung ating desktop app ng ating Teams, pwede tayong uh, pumunta dito sa ating navigation bar and click on Teams. May nagawa na ako dito na for Maramba and Ten Intengan because those are the two classes that I have to focus on every Monday. Sa Maramba din, uh, the advisor of Ten Maramba included me in their team. So whenever he posts announcements or other materials, nandun din ako to check or to add other materials uh, needed by the students of Ten Maramba. Meron din ako dito na... Then, Kapawan, so ano pa ba yung hindi ko pa nagawan? So, for the other teams, I already have those before. Kaya lang hindi ko talaga ginawa or tinapos lahat because it was not necessary and nakafocus talaga ako sa pag-check ng modules and giving assessment or feedback sa kanilang mga answer sheets. So, buo na tayo ng uh, another team. Dito, uh, dito sa join a team with a code, just for example, your head teacher or uh, the head of the curriculum instruction in your school would give you a code to join their team. Then enter lang natin yung code dito and then we can click join team. Kapag nakapag-encode uh, na kayo ng code, then just click join team. But for this tutorial, create tayo ng team. It's, this, it's basically the same with what I did last night. So, we have here, mas mabagal lang yung ating pacing today. We have class, professional learning community, kung sa division or in your cluster, meron kayong mga activities that you need to come up with videos or e-books. Pwede natin iselect yung ganong uh, classing team dito sa uh, PLC. Staff, if you need to give announcements to other staff in your institution. And there, and there, meron tayong others sa English Club, AV Club, 
or other uh, school activities that would require you to create the team. Sige, go lang kayo dyan. But for this, I would have the first option here is, uh, it's the class. So, class, lagyan ko lang yan ng name. Hindi ko pa nagawan yung 10 Juliano. And then, it's optional naman. You can put a description if you want. If if not, if you're not interested, then just click next. Okay. Search na tayo ng uh, mga students or punta ko dun sa file na meron ako for 10 Juliano. Ito. For this tutorial, I deleted the password on the uh, fifth uh, I mean, six column. So, kunin ko lang to. Copy ko lang siya. Then, go back. Yan. Lalabas yung kay R.G. Emanuel. And then, kunin ko pa yung isa. Lalabas naman yung kay Alpha Fara. And then, kay Anto. Here. So, later ko na lang i-add yung mga ibang students. Click Add. And close nyo muna to. Pwede pa naman kayo magdagdag ng mga ibang uh, students dyan. So, redirect na tayo dito. So, welcome to Ten Juliano. This is uh, welcome to Ten Juliano. Lagyan ko lang siya na, uh, just for example, I need to check or gusto ko, gusto ko na magdagdag ng mga members. You have to click I. Nakikita nyo itong I na to. It turns to blue. It turns blue. Kapag uh, nakiklik ko siya. And then, makikita natin dito yung number of members. Dito sa gilid, nakikita nyo to. There is an option to add members. So, pwede tayong makapag-add ng members ulit. I'll go to the same file na pinakita ko sa inyo kanina. And, add lang ako ulit ng member. So, lilitaw na dyan. Once you already have their LRN, lilitaw naman dyan yung name ng student. Then, close ko na ulit to. So, nandito na tayo sa uh, nandito na ulit tayo sa 10 Juliano. Let's upload class materials. Class materials. Makikita nyo dito. New, upload, sync, you, you, it's uh, it's actually the most efficient uh, thing to do, yung pag-click ng sync na ito. But, I'll have muna a sample. So, nilik ko yung class materials and I'll click upload, click files, and go to your documents or kung saan mang folder nakalagay yung gusto nyong i-upload the material. So, I'll be uploading quarter... 3, week, uh, week 1 to 7, or I mean week 1 to 6 na English 10 materials. So, let's wait while it's still uploading. Yeah, so we already have our uh, English 10 quarter 3 learning activity sheets in our 10 Juliano teams. Pwede kang mag-post dito. You can add another material. Uh, you can set up your class notebook. New conversation tayo. Pwede kang mag-post. Please submit a video of your self while having an argumentative speech. Yeah. So, I can post. Click na lang tong arrow. Please submit a video of yourself while having an argumentative speech or while delivering an argumentative speech. There is an option to attach a file. This can upload it from your computer. Have it from Google Drive, OneDrive, or Browse Teams in any other channel. So basically, once you have already uploaded a set of instructions or a file which has 
the list of your instructions in a given week, kung galing man yan sa ibang teams or channels, you can still uh, have that, transfer that, move that, or copy that in other teams or channels. So, marami na naman tayong alam about this. A lot of teachers can easily learn how to navigate uh, these learning, uh, uh, these types of learning platforms. We can easily adjust. We learned how to use Kahoot, Mentimeter, Nearpod, and yung sa Google Meet, yung una medyo uh, hindi pa tayo sanay uh, mag-present, especially if you need to present uh, materials na merong animation and then merong mga video or audio clips. Pero nasanay naman tayo in just a couple of days or just a couple of tries, perhaps. Meron din siyang mga GFs. Let's explore. Feeling grateful. Wow. Pwede tayong mag mag-send ng mga GFs, mag-post in our respective teams or channels. You have your assignments. You can give create assignments and quizzes, manage timelines, add grading rubrics, and more. Natulad ng nabanggit ko with my tutorial last night, ang favorite ko talaga ng uh, fe a feature or functionality ng MS Teams is that you have your calendar. Uh, click natin dito, I'm sorry. Click natin yung dot, dot, dot. And then you can see there your calendar. You can manage your files, organize your schedule, and do everything to make your work efficient. Yeah, explore din natin tong pag set ng ating mga schedules. And di ba, we have to come up with our action plan and accomplishment report. Isasabit natin at the end of the school year. So, swak na swak tong calendar na to. It can have all of your uh, files, your to-dos, and all of your accomplishment in just one file. Balikan mo lang lahat ng mga nasa calendar mo if you need to submit your accomplishment report. Ano ba yung mga nagawa ko? Ano ba yung mga nasubmit kong task on a specific day? So, ang galing, di ba? And... We're still expecting to have more or to learn more. Dami nating natutunan in this time of the pandemic. Okay na, I have nothing else to say. I'll see all of you soon. Makikita niyo na talaga ako na nagtuturo or doing my classes na mala teacher, broadcaster. But for now, we'll focus on what I can capture here on my screen. Goodbye, everyone.